Hey, welcome back to another Raised by Wolves Gaming episode, back with some more Destiny 2 weapon reviews, and thanks for joining us here again today. In this world of the Go Fast update, people seem to think that pulse rifles are really the thing to use, so I've been exploring the different pulse rifles that I have in my inventory, trying to figure out which ones might be good, and then testing them out. So today, I thought it might be interesting to go back and take a look at the Cadenza 43. This is a masterwork version that I have, it has adaptive frame, SLO 12 post, SPO 57 front and SRO 37 ocular. It has high caliber rounds, steady rounds, and outlaw precision kills greatly decrease reload time. Also have the masterwork weapon of 10 magazine. It increases the number of bullets in the magazine a little bit, but when you're talking about a burst rifle here, I think I think it gives you one more burst. Maybe it's two, but I think it's only one, so not hugely significant but maybe in certain circumstances that might come into play. Hopefully we'll get some kills before we have to get down to the bottom of the magazine. Linear fusion rifles also received a buff with the update, so let's take a look at the Dead Orbit Dead Ender. It has precision frame. Chambered Compensator, Extended Barrel, Small Bore, Particle Repeater, Projection Fuse, and Outlaw. Precision Kills greatly decrease reload time. Gonna use the Faux Tracer Helmet just because I haven't used it in a while. I have a couple of Energy Counterbalance mods for the Pulse Rifle. I have the Better Devils in the Kinetic slot just because why not? The Better Devils is good. So that's the loadout. Let's jump on into the action and see what we can do with the Cadenza 43 Masterwork version. Supremacy. Okay, here we go. We have some supremacy on the burnout with the Cadenza 43. Let's see if I can make sure no enemies come up this way. Nice, got the first kill. So we go get that for me, and I'm going to get this. Good. Yay, linear fusion rifle. I'm trying to get to a spot on this map where I can actually get a line of sight on somebody. Nope. Maybe outside I can get a shot with a linear fusion rifle? Um, no. Well, that was that was worth it. That was worth spending all that time to get. What? There we go. That's... Oh, no. Ah, oh, I didn't see the second one. Got him. Don't got him. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. What can stop? Yep. Okay. It's weird how the uh, damage registers on this pulse rifle for some reason. Okay. I'll take that. I'll take that. Okay. 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 Glory is yours. Fire team that fights. Good job, team. Good job. We're about to win this thing. Yeah, we did it. Okay. I don't know how much of a help I was, but we did it. Control. Okay, here we go. We got some control on Altar of Flame with the Cadenza 43. And let's see what we can do here. Well, we got a grenade kill. Oh no! Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. You saw that guy too late. Oh there he is. No, oh it's an it's another guy. Damn. Okay, there we go. Outgunned a Vigilance Wing at range. I like that. I think the high caliber rounds help there. I'm going to... Oh, no. Go ahead. Go ahead, teammate. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Go ahead. Let's see what we can see over here. It looks like there is some ammo up here. There we go. Grenade got a kill again. I need... I was going to say, I need a pulse rifle kill. Just Guys, there's two, there's two blocks of... Of heavy there. Oh, get, Hunter, can you get up on the ledge? Oh, now you can, and you're getting shot. 
There we go. Once again, outgunning the Vigilance Wing. Super weak. Super weak. Let's get out of here. No, 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 running, running, running. Oh no, I need a gr grenade. Stupid. Okay, don't worry guys, I got it. It's cool. It's cool, man. It's cool. Okay. Yeah, don't don't worry about it. Don't don't worry about it. It's fine. It's okay. We never needed this zone in the first place. Are you kidding me? Got him. I'm dead. Don't worry. I got it. I can outgun a Vigilance Wing at range with this thing. Okay? Just in case anybody's wondering. Don't worry. I can take out Skyburner's Oath. Can't take out three enemies at once, though. So, And a Fusion Rifle. Don't worry, guys. I got the Vigilance Wing, okay? I can take out the Vigilance Wing. This guy's just camping back here. Told you, this thing can outgun a Vigilance Wing at range. I've done it like three or four times this match. I feel good about it. I feel comfortable with it. There we go. Well done. Comes for us all. So this was a madly frustrating match, but it answered the question that I was looking to answer. And the thing I really wanted to look at, and this just doesn't have to be the cadenza, but really anything that has good long range high caliber rounds, how do you combat the Vigilance Wing? It can three burst at range quite easily. The deal is you have to hit those bursts, right? So I was thinking if you use a different pulse rifle, one that still has a decent rate of fire but has high caliber rounds, will it compete with the Vigilance Wing at range? And I think based on that final match, the answer is... A definitive yes. If you hit your high caliber shots at range, you can outgun a Vigilance Wing that's just spamming those five shot bursts at range. So that's good to know because it means you don't necessarily have to use Vigilance Wing in order to compete. I would say in the mid game, Vigilance Wing is probably still better, but you pair this with a really good auto rifle to take care of the mid game and you have a different package. You don't have to take up your exotic slot with the Vigilance Wing. So you can still throw something like <coughs> Colony into your power ammo slot and not have to worry about using only Vigilance Wing because you can't compete with it. So from that standpoint, I think they did a pretty decent job of balancing these pulse rifles so far. Haven't used them all. I still need to go back to the slow firing high impact ones. We'll take a look at some of those soon. But in the meantime, I'm going to go back and play some more Crucible with the Cadenza 43.